Hello. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? Hi, I feel very well. Very well. Nice. Okay. Good evening. Hello, hello. Let me just move my camera. There you go. Okay. Welcome. Welcome everybody to our class today. What day is today? Wednesday. Wednesday. Second. March 2nd. That's right. Correct. Of 2022, right? Of 2022. How are you? I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm great. I'm okay. I'm good. All right. Doing great. Doing fine. That's awesome. Okay. Let's see reactions. Your reactions. What are your reactions? Okay. Let's see. Uh huh. Vamos a ver. Reacciones, pongan alguna reacción que lo representa en este momento. Any reaction. Like party, happy, great, celebration. Uh -huh. Let's see. Any reaction for today? No reactions. <laughs> On the cell phones, I think you have no reactions, but yes, if you are from a computer, you do have a reaction. Okay. Oh, yes, a happy face. Nice. Mm -hmm. Any other reaction? No more? Okay, no problems, don't worry. Let's get started today with our class. Okay. Let me just move this right here. Okay, today we have the class number five, I think. We are starting our class number five. So welcome. Okay, the objective for this class we're going to review definitely have plus noun and feel plus adjective. I have a headache. I feel terrible. Remember that yesterday we were studying this. So we're going to name some type of medications and we're going to give advice. Okay. All right. There are some problems here. Okay. <laughs> What's wrong with him? The first person, what's wrong? Uh huh. He, have a he has a backache. He has a backache. Yes. What's wrong with him? He has an earache. He has an earache. Exactly. What's wrong with the third person? He has a stomach. Stomach. She has a headache. Uh -huh. And the next person, yes, he has a stomach. Ache. Right. What about the next person? What's wrong? Uh huh. He has. He has a tooth. A toothache. Yes, he has a toothache. Exactly. What's wrong with the next person? She has a cold. She has a cold. That's right. What about the next person? What's wrong? Uh -huh. he, he has, has a cough. He has a cough. Exactly. What's wrong with the next person? He, he has, has fever. 
He has a fever, exactly. Okay, and the next? She has the flu. She has the flu, exactly. And the next one? Mm -hmm. He has a sore eyes. He has a sore eyes. Sore eyes, perfect. Exactly. Sore eyes. No, it's okay, no problem. And the last one? A sore, a she, ha, she ha, no, he has a sore throat. Exactly. Mm -hmm. He has a sore throat. Exactly. All right. We're going to ask question. What's wrong? Like this. The example says, act out a health problem. Your partner gets the problem. Si en caso no puedan encender la cámara y no lo puedan como dramatizar, pues pregunten acerca de las imágenes, right? What's wrong with him? What, what's wrong with this person? O sea, ¿qué pasa o qué le pasa a esta persona? Yeah? He has a backache. What's wrong with him? Si es con hombre, tendría que ser with him. Si es con una mujer, tendría que ser with her. ¿Qué le pasa a ella? ¿Ya? Yeah? Eso es como la pregunta como, ¿qué pasa? ¿Qué hay de malo? Right? What's wrong? Entonces, si ustedes lo pueden actuar, pues perfect. Le dicen, what's wrong? Do you have a headache? No, I don't. Do you have an earache? Yes, I do. That's right. Yes? Si ustedes lo estuvieran actuando, por ejemplo, si ustedes dicen, ah, oh, oh. And then the other person asks, what's wrong? Do you have a headache? And you say, no, I don't. Do you have um, do you have fever? Oh yes, that's right. Yes? So it could be like that. Pero si no, pueden hacerlo con las imágenes, okay? For example, what's wrong with him? Does he have a a flu? Does he have the flu? Sorry? They no, he doesn't. Does he have um, a fever? Yes, that's right. Yes, así como está el ejemplo, pero lo pueden hacer con las imágenes o con actuando ustedes los problemas que tienen acá representados en cámara. Ok, let me see. We're going to make groups. I'm going to make five groups. Probably you're going to be in trios, groups of three. Y de la misma forma les voy a compartir la imagen. Ok, so don't worry. Let me see. Here we go. Okay, I already sent the image. Podemos ver la pantalla. ¿Cómo? ¿Y si vamos a poder vernos? vernos? Somos sí, seis. Igual, sí, no somos no la imagen. Uh, no sé. No sé si van a compartir alguien ahí la imagen. O no, si es en WhatsApp. Ahí cada uno lo puede ver. También no, no puedo compartir. La tengo aquí. Compártalo si puede, entonces. No me quedó muy bien, pero ahí está.
Sí, lo ven. No sé sí, sí. Lo... sí, sí. Se fue. No sé quién va a comenzar a preguntar. O cómo lo, cómo lo vamos a hacer. Sí, lo podemos hacer en pareja. Somos cuatro. Sí, somos cuatro. Ok, llegámoslo en pareja. Vaya. Me, me parece, me parece, podríamos hacerlo así. Sí, está bien, me parece. Okay. Vamos a ver, aquí quizás. Uh, aquí. What's wrong, this is? Or oh, with her? She had a cold. What broke so eight? Sí, pero tengo la imagen. Porque la imagen la compartieron con el grupo, pero creo que están conectados con el teléfono, creo que no se puede tener la imagen, ¿verdad? No, o, si, o si gusta, Lorena. Mejor den un ejemplo y yo lo sigo. Vale. Por ejemplo, ah, ahí está. ya la compartió. Ya lo visualizarlo. Sí, ya la imagen la tengo. El problema es que quiero ver un ejemplo, por lo menos para identificar, por lo menos al que está haciendo. ¿Cómo sí. se puede hacer la pregunta? Y ahora. La pronunciación de eso sí me cuesta un poquito. No sé ahí cómo sería, compañeras, alguien que nos pudiera ayudar. ¿La pronunciación de qué? Sorry. En la de. Erect. 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 Yes. Okay. All right. Thanks. You're welcome. Ahora las otras compañeras. Yo le pregunto. Sí, está bien. También okay. dijo que podíamos. This meeting is being recorded. Um, Wendy, yo le hago la pregunta. What's wrong with here? Huh? What's wrong with here? Yes, a fever. 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 a fever. Yes, 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 a fever. Sí, ¿quién es para hombre? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. What's wrong him? It's what, what's wrong him? Does he have a backache? Yes. He, he is a backache. He is. Uh -huh. Or it is. Oh, uh, oh, oh, he has. He, he has, has a backache. Mm -hmm. He has a backache. Mm -hmm. 
Mm -hmm. uh, what what grown hair? She have. Uh, she has a. She have a coat. Good. No pena. Can we commence, Eva? Once grown, once grown, do you have a wheelchair? No, I don't. Yeah. Do you have an an wheelchair? Yes, that's right. Okay. That's right. Okay. Quién más está ahí? Creo que. Ah, Mary Lee Kenya. Mary Lee Kenya, ¿no? Yo soy Kenia, pero ya participé. Ah, ok. Ah, no sé quién más no ha participado ahí. Medellín, entonces. Yo, ah, ah, Medellín. Ok. Cuatro. Lo que voy a entregar. Creo que no está. Hello. Creo que no está. Ah, el sí, está. Sí, sí, sí. ah ok. Entonces no, conmigo, no, pues. No, no, no. Okay. Si quieres comienzas tú. Sí, si uno se refiere, si uno se refiere a él, diría what's wrong with him, ¿verdad? o si se refiere a ella sería what's wrong with her. Okay. Uh -huh. Um, si quiere puede responder quien sea, solo voy a hacer la pregunta. What's wrong with him? Quizás a Sorcra. Okay, did you finish the practice? Yes? Yes. Perfect, thank you. All right. So if you have the photos, it was just follow the examples, right? Similar to the questions that you have here at the bottom, it says, what's wrong? If you wanna talk about the pictures, then you say, what's wrong with him? He has a backache. So you can say, what's wrong with him? Does he have an earache? No, he doesn't. Or I don't know. Does he have a backache? Yes, that's right, right? Uh, what's wrong with him? Does he have a fever? Mm, I don't know. Or no, he doesn't. Does he have an earache? Yes, that's right. Okay, so you can see follow this example at the bottom of your picture, right? So it's all right, no problem. Let's continue. Now we're gonna talk about some medications, okay? Some solutions to the problems, to the health problems. Okay, these are some of the medicines you might find. Let's start. Okay, solution. This is usually what you use to clean when you cut. Cough syrup is what you drink when you have the cough, when you've been like, <coughs> so you drink cough syrup, right? Antiseptic, you usually used to clean as well. Oral rinds is like the mouthwash. Lotion, when you go to the beach and you get sunburn, you usually get some body lotion. 
Yes, or sunblock. Discongestion spray it's when people have um, problems breathing or allergies, they usually get discongestants. Blood. This is when you are like in a very bad condition at the hospital. You might get like blood transfusions, do you think? Soft gels are the gels, uh, pills that we usually have when we have the flu, right? Ointment, uh, when you do exercise probably, and you have a lot of pain on your muscles, you usually get some ointments, right? Toothpaste, of course, we wash our teeth with, I mean, we brush actually, <laughs> yes, our teeth with toothpaste uh, to protect, to prevent that we get cavities in our teeth, right? Eye drops, when you have sore eyes, you usually use eye drops. Okay, lozenges, okay, this is... Um, Yes, usually uh, cups that we we have um, without drinking. So we just uh, kind of candy, similar to a candy for, for some problems. Okay, tablets is what we usually drink with water. Capsules can be any type of medicine or depending on the presentation, right? Couplets, aspirins, this is something we already know. Effervescence tablets and powder. Powder, usually we have, um, how do you call this one? Oh, when you use something to clean, probably, um, how do they call it? Sodio, I guess. We usually have this in this presentation, all right? Okay, here we have a doctor. <laughs> okay. And of course, the doctor is going, is going to prescribe medications, right? When you go to the doctor, they usually go like, okay, take these pills, take one in the morning, take one at night, or have this cough syrup. They give you a prescription, right? For health problems, they give you a prescription, and they give you the dosages that you have to take every six hours every eight hours depending of the problem right so that's why we have of course here in the previous image you have the doctors okay <laughs> all right so i'm gonna say this in spanish cuando ustedes mueven el mouse y estoy compartiendo la pantalla ustedes ven que hay como un menú flotante sí un menú flotante es que está el, el botón del, del micrófono, la camarita, otro que es el security, otro que es el participant, ¿sí? Es como un, un, un menú en negro que les aparece. ¿Quiénes ya lo logran ver? Cuando ustedes mueven el mouse. Sí, sí, sí. ¿Yes? Ven que les aparece uno que es como un lapicito, ¿sí? Que dice annotate. ¿Ya lo lograron encontrar? Yes. Vaya, elijan ese. Uh -huh. Yes. Vaya, van a elegir ese que dice Annotate. Yes, y van a elegir del que dice Draw. Donde dice dibujar, ¿verdad? Draw. Y luego van a elegir, ¿qué? La del corazón, por ejemplo, o la de la estrella, el que ustedes quieran. Por ejemplo, el heart. Ajá, exacto, para dibujar. Eso es lo que tienen que hacer. Bye. Los que ya hicieron alguna línea y todo, busquen donde dice eraser y la borran. <risa> Ahora, ay, no, teacher, manché todo esto. No, pero ahí tienen el eraser. Exactly, vaya. Cuando hayan elegido, ajá, exacto, el de la línea, ahorita no deben hacer nada hasta que yo les diga. Ok, vaya, el draw, el de la línea, el del corazón. Ok, 
Ay, vaya, drove, una línea. Déjenlo, sosténganlo ahí y lo que yo les diga es que encierren o le dibujen una, una línea alrededor, lo van a encerrar. ¿Yes? ¿Ready? O le ponen una marquita, puede ser un corazón, cualquier. Ya veo a Tatiana ahí sobre la pantalla. Vamos a ver, vamos a encerrar en un circle, eye drops. Vamos a ver quiénes lo logran hacer. ¿Recuerdan que? Exacto, era la opción, draw, y luego en una línea, I draw. Encerrar en un circle, dije, no manchar. No. <ríe> en lo que lo mancharon, borrelo. <ríe> en un circle. <ríe> Vaya, cool. Ok, circle, effervescent tablet. De aquello cuando tenemos stomach cake, ¿verdad? Ah, eso sí. Effervescent tablet. Ay, nos falla ahí un poquito el pulso. Vaya. Uh -huh. Effervescent tablet. Se me están encerrando las otras tablets, no cuento, ¿ok? Effervescent tablet. Vaya. Ya llevamos eye drops en effervescent tablet. Ok. Circle, cough syrup. Cough syrup. Ajá, perfecto. Alguien encontró el circle, oh, por eso sí. le queda bonito, ¿verdad? <risa> <risa> y los otros puro pulso. <risa> ok. Ok. Circle, ointment. 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 Exacto. Ointment. Uh -huh. Ok, nice. Circle discongestion spray. Para aquellos que le dan terapia, ¿verdad? Discongestion spray. spray. Ah, nice. Ya dos encontraron el circle. <laughs> ok. What about. What about. Toothpaste. Toothpaste. Exactly. Toothpaste. All right. <laughs> What about aspirin? Aspirin. Okay. <laughs> exactly. Hoy sí dándose duro con el con la figurita. <laughs> Blood. Blood. Okay. Ajá. Uh -huh. Nice. Antiseptic. An antiseptic. All right. Antiseptic. All right. Good. Bye. Antes de salirnos de esta pantalla, vamos a buscar el eraser y vamos a borrar. Como cuando borramos la pizarra. ¿No a ver? ¿Quién lo logra hacer? ¿Quién logra borrar primero? <ríe> Nice, great. Ah, va, él les ayuda algo. Ok, perfect. Ok, ya, ya pueden dejar el control salirse de ahí. No problem. Ok, great, good. All right. Va, les decía que cualquiera de esas medications le puede prescribir, prescribe a doctor. When you go to a doctor, when you have a health problem, ok. Definitely, it can be any of those prescriptions, okay? Let's listen. Dr. Young and Miss West. Dr. Young, Miss West. Hello, Miss West. How are you today? Not so good. So, what's wrong exactly? I'm exhausted. Hmm. Why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay, let's take a look at you. A few minutes later, <laughs> como en las movies, vea, two years later. <laughs> All right. Next year. Next, Next year. year. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> All right. I'm going to give you some pills. Take one pill every night after dinner. Okay. And don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Yes, don't work too hard. All right, thanks. 
Well, thanks, Dr. Young. Okay. One more time. Si hay alguna dificultad con pronunciation, me lo hacen saber para que lo repitamos, okay? So, lo voy a volver a repetir así, despacito, very slow. Hello, Miss West. How are you today? Not so good. Recuerden, aquí a la hora de dramatizar es importante que si usted es el patient, te tiene que sonar mal. Okay? <laughs> Not so good. So, what's wrong exactly? I'm exhausted. Mm. Why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay, let's take a look at you. A few minutes later. I'm going to give you some pills. Take one pill every night after dinner. Okay. And don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Yes, don't work too hard. All right. Thanks, Dr. Young. Okay. Any difficult word? ¿Hay alguna palabra que se les dificulte? Pronunciation, meaning, o algo que quieran entender que les quede más claro. ¿No? Teacher, yes. yo tengo una duda. Tell me. Eh, donde dice, so what's wrong? wrong. Exactly. Esa palabra se me dificulta. But. Ahí lo que tenemos que hacer es como disimular un poco la W. Acuérdense que la W y la Y se van a comportar como semi-consonants o como semi-vowels. En este caso es como una semi-consonant. Se dice, what's wrong? Hay que hacer un poquito de gargara. Como, what's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? Exactly. La W suena pero muy leve. What's wrong exactly? What's wrong exactly? ¿Alguien más? ¿Alguien más tiene una mano levantada? ¿Somebody else? No? Sorry, teacher. Yes, tell me. Exhausted, así se dice. Exhausted, como ah. Oh. Exhausted. 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 I'm exhausted. Yes. Okay. Como Thank una O oh, un poquito grande, exo, exhausted, yes. Exhausted. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. Bye. Vamos a hacer pairs. Hoy sí vamos a trabajar in pairs. Creo que tal vez alguien quede. No sé si Melvin va a preguntar algo más. Somebody? Melvin? Mr. Mejia? Do you have any Thank question? You. Yes? Tell me. No questions? No, teacher. No. Okay. So, in pairs or in trios, but try to practice everybody, okay?
Not so good. So what's wrong exactly? I'm exhausted. Mm, where, why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay, let's take a look at you. A few minutes later. I'm going to give some pills. Take one pill every night after. Uh, um, I'm going to give you some pills. Take one pill every night after dinner. Okay. And don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Yes. Don't work to her. All right. Thanks, Dr. John. Bye. Bye. How are you today? Not so good. So what's wrong exactly? I'm exhausted. Hmm. Why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay. Let's take a look at you. Uh, I am going to give you some 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 pills. This uh, oh, pills. Uh -huh. Pills. Take on pills every night after dinner. Okay. And don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Yes, don't work too hard. All right, thank you. All right, thanks, Dr. Young. Bueno, ahora usted, Lorena, eh, no, no va a preguntar a alguna de nosotros dos. Para que practique también, eh, para que practiquemos también. Doctor, ¿tú se pregunta también? Coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Yes, don't work too hard. All right, thanks, George. June. Okay, okay, cambiamos. Okay. Hello, Mr. West, how are you today? Not so good. So what's wrong exactly? I am exhausted. Mm, we are just so tired. I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay, let's stay a lot. I do. I going to gym. Do some pills. Stay on pill every night after dinner. Okay. I don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Yes, don't go to her. All right. Thanks, Dr. John. Okay. Anything else? Yes, don't go to her. All right, thanks, Dr. John. Excellent. Okay. Hello, Miss Grace. How are you today? Not so good. So, what works exactly? I'm exhausted. Mm. Why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay, let's take a look at a look at you. Um, I'm going to give you some pills. Take one pill every night after dinner. Okay.
Hi, teacher. Hello, did you finish? Yes. All right, no problems? No, no problems. All right, cool. Hey, how was it? How was the practice? Nice. Was good, <laughs> all right. Fine, fine, thanks. Teacher. All right, nice. Everybody practice? Yes. <laughs> yes, yes. Okay. Yes. Any question? Yeah. No questions? It was easy? Okay. Did you change anything? No? You practice exactly the conversation the way it is? Exactly. All right. <laughs> no problem. Okay. One thing you can change probably is your last name. For example, say hello. Miss West, instead of saying hello, Miss West, you can say hello, Miss Hernandez, hello, Miss Marroquin, right? So you say the name. How are you today? Well, you can still ask the same question. Not so good or so bad. I feel terrible. I feel so bad, probably. You can change that. So what's wrong exactly? You can ask the same question. I am so tired. I feel so probably so low energy, okay? You can say that similar, okay? Why are you so tired? Why are you so exhausted, right? I don't know. I can't sleep at night. I have insomnia. I have a headache. I have a backache, right? So you can say other symptoms probably. Okay, let's take a look at you. That is when the doctor start examining, right? So you say, oh, I'm going to give you some pills. I'm going to give you these tablets. I'm going to give you these vitamins. I'm going to give you, I don't know, any other medication, right? Take one pill or take one tablet after, after breakfast or three times a day or two times a day, right? So you can kind of change the information, but with similar meaning, right? And then say, okay, and do more exercise, eat more vegetables, or I don't know, relax before going to sleep, okay? <laughs> Try to, to change the, the symptoms and the recommendations, of course, right? And don't work too hard, could be like, don't worry too much, don't... Uh, don't drink coffee or usually the doctors give you a lot of prohibition. Don't drink soda. Exactly. Don't drink uh, snacks. I mean, don't eat snacks. Don't, don't eat candies. Don't eat sugar. Usually they say similar recommendations, right? Then you say, all right, thanks, Dr. Martinez. Or thanks, Dr. Ramirez. I don't know whatever last name you can have, right? So, traten de, como de role play, como de imaginarse la última vez que fueron al doctor. ¿Y qué les dijo? ¿O qué le dijeron ustedes? <laughs> right? If you went to a doctor, you say, oh, I went to the doctor because I had the flu, I had a headache, I had a stomachache, I had a backache, I had a toothache. Probably, right? So maybe it was a dentist, the last doctor that you visited. Yes, Miss Nivia, tell me. Um, ¿Qué significa anything else? Algo más. Okay. Ajá, como Algo anything más. else? Anybody else? Alguien más? Anything? Es algo más? Alguna cosa? Alguna otra cosa? Uh -huh. Okay, thanks. No problem. Ok, so traten como de parafrasear o de roleplay la conversación 
acerca de su última vez que fueron a, al doctor, ¿ok? I'm going to give you two more minutes para que la traten como de poner más en contexto real. En el mismo grupo donde estaban, la misma conversation, pero cambiando. Los names, los symptoms y las recommendations. Yes? Vamos a ver, one more time. Traten de ser lo más eficiente posible. No tiene que ser exactly todo lo que dicen ahí, pero sí como de no cambiar el, el contenido. I mean, no cambiar el contenido de la, de la conversation que es doctor patient, ¿verdad? Pero sí de cambiar los names, los symptoms y las recommendations. All right, here we go. Hello, how are you today? This meeting Hello. is being recorded. Hello, Mr. Marvin. Solamente. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Marvin. Uh -huh. uh, how are you? I feel sad. ¿Cómo? I feel bad. I feel bad. Me siento mal. I uh, I feel uh, I feel sad. Me siento triste, podríamos decir, no sé, alguna palabra de esa. Podríamos también uh, poner los, los síntomas. I, I am fever. Ajá. Um, uh -huh. I, I, a Ajá, igual podríamos cambiar en eso donde dice Why are you so tired? Entonces podríamos decir Why are you so 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 bad? Porque te sientes mal o algo así, ¿no? Ok, sí. Every every night after dinner. Okay. Um. Don't try soda or coffee. Um, yes. Don't work too hard. All right, thanks, Doctor. Uh, todavía no la ve. Sí, 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 sí. Ah. Okay, let's take a look at you. Uh, uh, I am going to give you some food. Stay up every night. After diner. Ok. Y ahí me puede decir que no coma algo, que sí Bye. coma algo. Ajá. I don't drink coffee, tea, beer, horchata, tamarindo, water cool, 
Não, 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 não. Pupusa, na, na fé. Não consigo. Pupusa, não. Ai, não. <risos> I feel minus layer. I'm going to give you some stuff. Take one piece every night after dinner. Okay. And don't drink coffee or soda. Anything else? Yes. Don't work too hard. Thanks, Dr. Martinez. Okay. Coffee, tea, or soda? Es no, verdad? Podríamos dejarla. Okay. Uh -huh. Vale, si quieren, empecemos. Okay. Empiezo yo. <laughs> De acuerdo. Vale. Hello, eh, hello, Mr. Pero, permítanme. Hello. I'm going to give you. I'm going to give some pills. There's one pill every lunch. Uh, every day, sorry, every day after lunch and night after dinner. Okay. I don't drink tea or coffee. Okay. Yes, did you change the conversation? <laughs> now we have new conversations. Uh -huh. Volunteers to say that new conversation. Some are still practicing. <laughs> okay. It was hard. It was hard. Really? Difficult. It was difficult. A little. Just a little. You just have to use your imagination. And remember. Remember the time when you go to the doctor. Yeah. Do exercise. Don't drink soda. Don't eat sugar. <laughs> Don't eat any fat don't eat a snack don't eat candies right so just remember when you go to the doctor and the recommendations they give you okay so any volunteer to say the new conversation alguien que nos quiera compartir lo que le cambiaron a la conversation de los que hayan trabajado juntos obviously right yo all right Miss Nidia, your partner is? Eh, Eva, con Eva. Yeah. All right. Are you Ajá. ready, Miss Eva? Pero no sé si nos puede compartir okay. la pantalla porque se no. Okay. Se la comparto. Don't worry. Don't worry. Let's be happy. Okay. Ready? One, two, three, go. Hello, Miss Eva. How are you today? I do not feel well. So what your problem exactly? I feel very tired. Mm, why are you tired? I don't know who's staying sick at night. Okay, let's take a look at you. I'm going to give some pills. Takes one pills uh, every day at lunch and 
one night after dinner. Okay. I don't drink coffee, chocolate, tea, or soda. Anything else too? Yes, don't worry too hard. All right, thanks, Dor Dr. Nidia. <laughs> Dr. Maro, <Okay>. sí. <laughs> okay, nice. Good job. Wonderful. Remember, when we use the title, we usually use the last name, okay? Yes? So, <laughs> Miss Barrera, Miss Mendez, Dr. Mendez, Dr. Lemus, yes? We usually use the last name. Okay, great. Okay, as I was saying, in this conversation, definitely, I me voy a usar el spotlight para que se pueda ver mejor. Decimos, haga esto, no haga esto. Eso es dar indicaciones. Y dar indicaciones en inglés se conoce como imperatives. ¿Ok? For example, en la segunda parte le dice, I'm going to give you some pills. Take. One pill every night after dinner. O sea, tómese una pill cada noche después de la cena. Entonces, eso es como dar una instruction, lo que les comentaba, lo de los imperatives, ¿verdad? Creo que ya lo, hayan, ya lo habrán visto en la platform que dice, haga esto, no haga esto, ¿ya? Entonces, take one pill every night after dinner. Esa es una instruction. Ajá, como ya le dice, ok. Don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. O sea, que la instruction yo la puedo dar de forma afirmativa y de forma negativa. Haga esto, no haga esto. Ok, take one pill every night after dinner. Es de forma afirmativa. Yes. Don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Es de forma Negativa. ¿Y qué otra le da de forma negativa? Uh -huh. Don't work too hard. Don't, don't, don't work too hard. Too hard. O sea, de forma afirmativa van a iniciar con la acción. Haga esto. Y de forma negativa van a iniciar con don't. Don't work too hard. ¿Ok? Eso es algo de lo que vamos a, a ver del día de mañana, lo de los imperatives, vamos a darle un poquito más de estudio. Take a pill every four hours. Don't work too hard. Rest in bed. Don't stay up late. Drink lots of juice. Esto es algo que generalmente nos dicen cuando tenemos problemas de, de fiebre, de flu. Drink lots of water. Drink lots of juice. Tome muchos líquidos, le dicen. Don't drink soda. Yes. Entonces, de forma afirmativa, van a iniciar de una vez con la acción que se debe hacer. Se le dice, descanse, haga ejercicio, coma saludable, right? Entonces, son los imperatives de forma afirmativa y de forma negri van a iniciar con don't. Don't smoke, don't drink soda, don't, uh, don't take a lot of sugar, Don't eat a lot of fat. O sea, no, usa, no coma grasas, no, no haga esto, eso, esto, esto. ¿Ya? Yeah? Entonces, de esa forma se dan las instructions usando imperatives. Como cuando usted tiene hijos y le dice, go to bed, study, finish your homework, clean your bedroom. O sea, está dando instructions. Entonces, obviamente en este contexto es de doctors, no de parents, ¿ok? No es para que se desahoguen con los children ahorita. O, no es eso, niño. Don't do that. <ríe> ok. No molestes al perro. Don't bother the dog. O sea, entonces, instructions, ¿verdad? Haga esto, no haga esto. Esos son los imperatives. Obviously, van, de, van a depender del contexto. En este contexto es de doctor, patient, ¿verdad? Puede ser de parents, children, teachers, students, qué sé yo. Ok. O oh, jefe, empleados, whatever. Pero en este caso, el contexto de la unit lo presenta así. From the doctor to the patient. ¿Ok? ¿Any question? ¿Cómo les está yendo con la platform? Good. No so good. Good. Good teacher. Good. Good teacher. Good. 
Okay. Ayer me gustó muchísimo y quiero felicitarlos por eso. Cuando tengan alguna duda, compártanla en el grupo, así los demás pueden ver. Si alguien lo resolvió, le puede ayudar. Okay. Yo justamente en ese momento dije, voy a esperar a ver quién reacciona y igual, si es, esa era la respuesta. Okay. So, very good. Keep it up. Okay. Good job. All right. May God bless you and I see you tomorrow. Okay, bye. 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 Bye.